am a senior procurement specialist in the procurement services department, so I am in charge of the uh, medical and surgical commodities, specifically pre-op services, uh, the heart program like the cath lab and medical imaging. What contract she's working on at the end of the day, we're all here to um, you know, save money for the hospital, still have quality and ensure that the patient is taken care of. She is very empathetic and sympathetic and puts everybody's needs ahead of her own. Always. I won the Compassionate Award and I was really surprised because um, I always thought that these type of awards were given to nurses or to doctors or people that work directly with the patients. But when it was a service department, then it made me thought of, yeah, in a way, everything that we do, every time we uh, issue an RFP, award a contract or negotiate pricing, we'll do it for the patients, which are our end users. Judy is a very humble individual. Uh, easily approachable so she's sort of been everybody's mentor and coach and people are just naturally drawn to her because she's so easygoing um, and friendly. When I was had the opportunity to be the acting manager in three different opportunities in the past seven years so with the staff right you talk to them and if they have an issue or they have a problem and you help them so you apply compassion that way. Even if it's just listening or just giving a little advice or just uh, tell them, don't worry, everything is going to be better, that's enough. I would think that she came from a clinical background in terms of how the patient is number one in all of her thoughts, in terms of anything that needs to happen in an emergency, a recall situation, um, in the event of us being out of stock of something or the department, um, the way that she takes action immediately, makes you feel as though she's been there, she feels it. Whenever I used to feel stressed out or overwhelmed with the amount of work, um, I just went to one of the ICUs or one of the nursing units and only by passing by and you see the patients that they really need your help. So you feel encouraged and energized to go back to your desk and then work harder or think of, okay, if I manage to get this product sooner, the patients will benefit. So, so that's how I will apply compassion to my job. She has been there to support the department through a lot of hardships and change. She has persevered even when things haven't necessarily gone in her direction. I'm honored to have been a part of this special day and she deserves this award. I think she should have probably got it many, many moons ago, but I'm so happy that it has come and she's absolutely deserving of it. Like I said, when I was given the award, I wanted to share it with my team because we went through a um, restructuring of the department. So the past few months have been a little bit hard for all of us and helping each other and treating each other with compassion has helped us going through.